in the air lounger, and this is how you're supposed to fill it up, one chamber at a time. <laughs> um, yeah, or run or something. Hey, wait! Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! There you go. Now fill it up. Now close it. No, wait, close it. <laughs> now you gotta do the other one. What other one? There's another chamber. Oh my God. <laughs> that's that's kind of like sort of kind of almost doing it. And then you got to roll it together and yeah. So I don't think we have enough air in the second chamber though. See this chamber Ugh. here, this one. You have to open that one. And do that one and see if that works. And then once you get that one filled, almost, 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 you did good. Well, I need you around for all of it. Okay. This is obviously, unless you have about 35 mile an hour wind, not going to work perfectly. You roll it first before you do that. Roll it. Roll it. Yes. You roll it like, like uh, this. Roll it, roll it up. Yeah, roll it until you get some three or four times. That should be about right, supposedly. And yeah, we don't have enough air in it, obviously. You're going to sit on that and it's going to sink. It's supposed to hold up to 400 pounds or something like that. So, ripstop nylon, I mean, it's not going to fall apart, but. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, maybe if you started at the other end, but hey. That's about what it looks like, and then you just kind of, like, yeah. My back is on the ground. I suggest getting a fan to do this, unless you have a lot of energy to run. Thank you very much for watching my video. I was given this at a reduced price for my honest review, and all opinions are my own.